بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹ ٹوڈے آئی ول سالو اینڈر میتھ لمپیڈ پرابلم اینڈ دس از دا جومیٹریکل شیپ پرابلم ناؤ ان دس پرابلم وی ول فائنڈ دی ایریا آف دس گرین ریجن دا کوشچن از دیٹ گیون دیٹ اے ریکٹینگل اے بی سی ڈی ایریا آف ٹرائنگل اے ایکس ٹی ایکس پی وائی ڈی وائی سی آر فائیو فور تھری ریسپیکٹیولی فائنڈ دی ایریا آف ٹرائنگل ڈی ایکس وائی یو کین سی ہیئر اے ایکس ٹی ایریا آف ٹرائنگل از فائیو ایکس بی وائی ایریا آف ٹرائنگل از فور ڈی وائی سی از ایریا آف ٹرائنگل تھری نو وی ہیو ٹو فائنڈ ڈی ایکس وائی نو فرسٹلی وی سپوز دیٹ اے ایکس ایکول ٹو اے لیٹ سپوز دیٹ A x length will be equal to A and x b x length is suppose that equal to B. Therefore, we can uh, write this name as A and this length is B. Now you write it as B length. Now, now we write the length A D in terms of A and B. We see that the area of triangle A x T here is Five. You can see here. This is the five unit square. Now we write area of triangle AXT that is equal to one over two times AD into AX. Now here is AD is five. Therefore, we write it five equal to one over two. Now AD. It is written as it is, and a x equal equal to a. Therefore, the a d will become. You can see here, the a d will be equal to five times two is ten. Ten over a. Next, we find the length b y in terms of a or b. Now we take the area of triangle x p y. That will be equal to one over two. B y multiply B x. Now we can write it as area of triangle x b y. We we know that is four unit square. We write it four equal to one over two. Now we write B y is written as it is into B x. B x is a. Therefore we can write it B y is equal to four times two is eight. Eight over B. Now, next we see that length of BY is eight over B, and the length of AD we already find that length is ten over A. Now we can write it as the length YC in terms of AB. That is total length. You see here, AD is ten over A, and BY is eight over B. Therefore, YC length can be written as AD minus B Y that value will be equal to ten over A minus eight over B. Therefore, this length is ten over A minus eight over B. Now, next is the length of D C in terms of A B. That length will be equal to A plus B. We can write it A plus B. Now we find area of triangle D Y C. See that's equal to one over two. Base length is DC into YC, and that value is DYC is equal to three. The area of triangle is already given in the question. You can see here. This is the value three. Now next is the DC is equal to A plus B, and YC is equal to. 10 over a minus 8 over b. Now you can see here that's two will shift from right side to left side. That's equal to six. Equal to we multiply a into 10 over a, we get 10. Now a multiplied by 8, we get minus 8 a over b. Next is we multiply b to 10 over a, we get 10 b over a, and same as b multiplied by minus 8 over b, we get minus 8. Now we simplify it. We get uh, that value is 
10 minus 8 is 2 and when we shift 2 from right to left side that value 6 minus 2 that is equal to 4 and that is 10b over a minus 8a over b. We suppose that b over a is considered as if r we can write it 4 equal to 10r minus 8 over b a over b we can write it 1 over r therefore 8 into 1 over r. Now this equation can also be written as when we multiply it by r we get 4r that is equal to 10r square minus 8 and now we can write it as 10r square minus 4r minus 8 equal to 0 and that value be, will take the 2 as a common that value become 5r square minus 2r minus 4 equal to 0. Now we can calculate the value of r by using quadratic formula. Now 5r square minus 2r minus 4 equal to 0. We write the quadratic formula here minus b plus minus b square minus 4ac our two time of a. Now we can write it as minus b is this is the b minus b is minus 2 plus minus and b square is 2 minus 2 whole square minus 4 times into a is 5 c is minus 4 and our 2 into 5 a is 5 you can see here this is a this is b and now we can write it as r, uh, sorry, we can write it as uh, x is uh, in place of x, we write it as r, then the r will be equal to 2 plus minus, four, 2 square is 4 plus 4 times 5 is 20, and 20 into 4 is 80, now our 10. Now we can write it. 2 plus minus 84 is the mul 4 multiplied 21 is 84. Therefore, we can write it as 2 plus minus 2 square root of 21 over 10. Now we take 2 as a common. Therefore, that value become 1 plus minus 21 over 5. Now, this is the value of R. Now we have to find area of triangle DXC that will be equal to, you can see here the total area of rectangle into area of rectangle. You can see here area of rectangle minus area of minus area of triangle three triangles that is area of triangle axt bxc and cdy these areas are five four and three we subtract the area of triangle uh, these three triangles minus five minus four minus three now area of rectangle you see here that is equal to dc into ad dc into ad we can write it dc multiply by AD. Now the DC length is A plus B uh, and AD is, you can see here, this is the AD length. Now you can see this is the AD length 10 over A. Now we write it as 10 over A and that is equal to uh, minus four, 5 minus 4 minus 9 minus 3 that is equal to minus 12. Now we can write it minus 12. Now that value becomes uh, multiply a into 10 over a that value is 10 now b into 10 over a that value become 10 b over a minus 12 now that value will be equal to minus 2 plus 10 b over a you know b over a is equal to r we already here is b over a equal to r we can write it as minus 2 plus 10 r and here is r is you can see here this is the r now we take the value r is positive only positive value 1 plus 21 square root 5 positive real number positive 
real value. Now that value will 1 plus k root 21 over 5. Now we write it minus 2 plus 10 into 1 plus, sorry, 1 plus 21. Now we can write it 1 plus 21 square root over 5. And that is 10 into 1 plus square root over 5. 5 times 2 is 10. Now we get minus 2 plus 2 plus 2 over square root of 21. 2 will be cancelled. Now the value become 2 under root 21. And this is the required area of triangle AD area of triangle DXC. This is the uh, area of the green triangle. And this, this is the method we here we use to find this triangle.